Good day everyone, you're watching Ratio Fixes. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix if the spell checker is not working in Microsoft Teams. Now, to fix this issue, uh, the first step, what you will have to do is you will have to go ahead and reset the Teams app on your computer. To do this, you will have to close Microsoft Teams so and also close the Microsoft Team instances. To do this, you may go ahead and do a right click on Microsoft Teams on your taskbar and then click on Quit. Once it is done, uh, the next thing what you will have to do is you will have to do a right click on the start button and then click on settings. Once you're on the settings page, you will have to go ahead and click on apps on the left hand side. Once you click on apps on the right hand side of this window, you will have to go ahead and click on installed apps where you will see the list of apps which are installed in your windows. In the search, you may go ahead and click on teams and click and click on the three dotted or the ellipses at the top right corner click on advanced option once you're on the advanced option you will have to scroll down a bit and go ahead and look for a reset option under reset you will have to go ahead and click on repair now you'll have to wait for the repair to complete once the repair is complete the next step, what I would also suggest you to do is I would suggest you to also reset Microsoft Teams and wait for the reset to complete. Once this is done, you may go ahead and try to open Microsoft Teams. And uh, during this process, you will be you might be prompted to enter your credentials to uh, log into your Microsoft Teams. So let's try to open Microsoft Teams. So once you have Microsoft Teams open, uh, the next step, uh, what I would uh, check if the spell checker is working in your Microsoft Team. Now, in spite of trying this step, and if you're still facing a problem, if the spell checker is still not uh, working, the next step, uh, what I would suggest you to do is I would suggest you to go ahead and enable the spell check in Microsoft Teams. Now, to do this, you will have to click on the three dotted lines or the ellipses at the top right corner, where you would see settings and more. Under this, you will have to go ahead and click on settings. Once you're on the settings page, under the general tab, make sure the spell check has been enabled for your um, Microsoft Teams. And to make sure the spell checker is enabled, you will have to close Teams and relaunch Team and check if the spell checker is working. This is one step. Now, if it is working, well and good, you don't have to try the next step. Now, in spite of trying this step and if you're still facing a problem, now the next step, what I would suggest you to do is I would suggest you to go ahead and delete the Teams cache from your computer. Now, to delete the Teams cache, uh, what you will have to do is you will have to close Microsoft Teams from the taskbar. So you can go to the Windows taskbar and if you see Microsoft Teams, you may go ahead and do a right click and click on quit. So once it is done, uh, the Microsoft Teams instance is closed from your computer. Once it is done, you will have to go to the location. Um, you can go ahead and do a right click on the start button and click on run. In the run window, you may go ahead and type the command which says percentage app data percentage. Click on OK. Once you click on OK, look for the Microsoft folder. Under Microsoft folder, you would see a Teams folder. In my case, you wouldn't see the Teams folder because I have deleted that folder. So go to the Teams folder and delete uh, all the content what you have in the Teams folder. So in case if there are any files or folders, you may go ahead and select all and delete. So what you're doing here is you're going ahead and clearing the Teams cache from your computer. Um, from cache from your computer. Once it is done, you may go ahead and restart your computer. Once you restart your computer, um, then check if your spell checker is working in your Microsoft Teams. If it works, well and good, you don't have to try the next step. Now as the next step, uh, what I would suggest you to do is to autocorrect or highlighting works. So to do this, you will have to do a right click on the start button, click on settings. Once you're on the settings page, you may go ahead and click on time and language. Under this, on the right hand side, click on typing. Now here, make sure the autocorrect misspelled words and highlight misspelled words are enabled. So in case if they are disabled, make sure these two options are checked. 
and then try to open Microsoft Teams and check if the spell checking is working um, in your uh, Windows. Now, in spite of trying all this step and if you're still facing a problem, now as a next step, what I would suggest you to do is I would suggest you to go ahead and uninstall and reinstall Teams. Now, to do this, you will have to do a right click on the Start button and then click on Settings. Once you're on the Settings page, you will have to go ahead and click on Apps on the left hand side, and then click on Installed Apps on the right side of this window. Under this, you will have to go ahead and locate for Microsoft Teams. So you may go ahead and search for Teams from this list. Click on the three dotted lines or on the ellipses and click on uninstall. Once you go ahead and uninstall your Microsoft Teams, you may go ahead and restart the computer and download Microsoft Teams from your um, Teams website. So you can go ahead and go to microsoft.com forward slash teams and download Microsoft Teams. Once you download and install Microsoft Teams, check if the spell checker is working. Now this should ideally fix a problem. Now in spite of trying all this step and if you're still facing a problem, I would suggest you to leave me a comment in the comment section so that I can come up with a possible solution. I hope this video was useful. In case if you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Have a great day.